Hey everyone, Arctic Shadow here, and welcome back to the first episode of the year of Crush Crush. You know, not including that half episode that I made about Claudia. Speaking of which, we have the event going on for her that is almost done. So, yeah, I should pretty much have her pretty soon, I'm guessing. We also have a new phone fling. And lastly, I did get Tessa's outfit, so I will most likely get a chance to show all that off when I'm waiting on Francine to talk to me again. Hello, bonjour! How are you doing today, my beautiful little guimauve? Yeah, you see, that's what I mean. I'm probably not gonna... Let's see, well now that someone has called me beautiful, I'm doing pretty darn great. Oh you, saying that I'm beautiful. <laughs> okay, anyways. Almost reminds me of the, do you come with the car? Oh you. <laughs> um, hello, who's this? Oh, my petite. Guimauve. You are so funny sometimes. A bonjour, a parlez-vous français. You make my cheeks hurt from laughing so much. Tell me, my darling, are you alone right now? Do you have privacy? I think we're alone now. I have intimate details to share with you. Doesn't seem to be anyone around. I think so. I can totally block my screen so no one can peek at it too. Yeah, that way, if you're sending me naughty pictures, I don't get in trouble, or someone looks at me and they're like, Cochino! Or, Pervert! I'm not sure where this is going. I think we're alone now. The beating of our hearts is the only sound. My darling, it is going where it's, uh, where it's always going with you and I. Into secrets and sweet things. You and your sweet nothings. Alright, hold on. I'm going to step into somewhere more secluded and activate a special feature on my phone. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Alright, allow me to introduce myself. I must be quick because I only have a few text messages to explain the situation. Let's see, oh. There's something sneaky going on here. Alright, I'm listening. Reading. Whatever. Don't judge me. It's my life. It never ends. <laughs> Your profile has said you had a sense of humor. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm sorry. I'm kind of dipping into my Sophia voice a little bit. Yeah, I can't do French accents, so sorry. But I can do the Spanish accent more or less okay, but... I mean, it kind of helps that I am of Spanish... Well, Hispanic descent. My name is Francine. I work for... The DGSI. Huh, <laughs> those are my initials, but in the wrong order. Minus the I. Direction Generale de la Securité in Tori... Ah, see. Okay, I'm gonna guess that she works on international security, you know, huh? You know, if we go off Spanish and French having at least some kind of shared roots with Latin and all that, I am a spy, a French spy. I am being tracked by a group of elite hackers, and my life is in danger. A spy, you say? Show Miss Francine. Tell me, what might an exotic beauty like you be doing in my neck of the woods? And what have you done to attract so much attention? I have activated jamming software on my phone, but I can only send around two kilobytes of data before it's useless. Mura, 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 mura! I have encrypted two encrypted er encrypted to encrypted. <laughs> I have intercepted two encrypted files. 
I desperately want to send to my superiors. I want to use you as my relay. Okay. Say we, said Vu. But I. Ah. Right now, you are my only hope. Help me, Obi Wan Kenobi. You are my only hope. But how are you going to send me the data? Are you going to send it to me the way Jin Erso sent out the Death Star plans? Because it didn't quite work out for her, or Cassian Andor, or any of her friends there. Awesome! This is awesome! Are you a hot spy? I bet you're hot. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to send the stupid answer. Ha ha ha! We matter. Ah. See, now I'm speaking gibberish. I'm speaking French gibberish. I'm a little, how do you say, easy on the eyes? Oh uh, ho ho ho. I love see hockey. Oh ho ho ho. Yep, it's like anyone living in France or Quebec or anyone who speaks French in, gen French in general. Ah. You're probably going to hate me for however many episodes I'm here with Francine. My clever trick is to hide the data inside of photos I send you. As long as it looks like we are lovers exchanging naughty texts, my pursuers will be none the wiser. Now please, I can only send one or two more texts incognito. I got your number f from your secret file, DGSI. It said you are a heroic person. I was about to say, why do I have a file? Well, in the immortal words of Bonnie Tyler, I need a hero! I'm holding out for a hero to the end of the night. He's gotta be strong, and he's gotta be fast. He's gotta be larger than life. I'll do it! For France! We, oui. Viva la France! Viva la France! <coughs> okay. That was my poor imitation of Marie Antoinette from Fate Grand Order. From now on, we are new lovers who miss each other terribly while I am visiting my home country. The more flirtatious we are, the better it will work. As soon as the jammer is off, I will send you the first file. And it's gonna take one hour. I'll be wetting. Ah, wetting. I'm not drunk, I'm Scottish, remember? Okay. I shall be waiting for you, my beautiful, exotic beauty. Okay, anyways, Tessa time. Well, technically I was gone for like days and days, but she doesn't need to know that. Oops, I passed it. Okay, school uniform time. I'm sending you to obedience school! Now I can sneak up on that stupid school bus undetected! I'm sure to catch it this time. Okay. I bite you! Man, look at the stockings. Pounty hose. Seems like she's been getting fashion tips from Monica. Anyways, bathing suit. We kind of already saw this. <laughs> well, I don't think it look any good on me. And... I would like to hope that you wouldn't take it off. And make me try it on while you have nothing. Then I'd feel kind of... awkward. Let's see, put a ring on it. Oh man, I'm going to rip the crap out of this dress! I'm so excited! Oh, look at that, her hair's in a different style now. And... Well, I guess it's a good thing I'm not buying the dress. You know, for some reason it kind of looks like Flower Girl meets Greek Goddess. It's probably... You know, this stuff, and then... Anyways. Oh my gosh! I love you so much! Every time you touch me, I feel infinity love for you! You're so good at that! Okay, looks like she said the secret word. Let's see, I guess I'll decide if I want to put the song in later. Oh, and 
speaking of which, looks like she has some kind of a... a strap. Maybe she is going for the Greek goddess kind of thing. Maybe she has like some golden gladiator sandals going on. <laughs> well, unfortunately I'll never know because I can't see beyond her knees. Anyways, let's get ready for Christmas! Almost two months later! No. No. Oh my gosh! I look... Oh my... <laughs> stop! 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 No, I'm just joking. Do that for always! Okay. Anyways. Okay, well, I guess she does have a bunch of ribbons on her and one stocking, I think. Okay, well, I guess that's it for Tessa's outfits. Let me just go ahead and put her back the way I found her. That way she doesn't stay like that for who knows how long, the way I did with Shibuki. Okay, and I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and maybe just wait out this hour. Because, I mean, you know, it's only an hour. And I'd rather try to hang on to my diamonds as much as I can. I want to get back to 300 diamonds, dang it! Okay, well... Anyways... I guess... It's gonna be a new seg- well... Okay, no, I guess I won't say it's a new segment, it's just gonna be a time skip. Okay, see you guys in an hour. Okay, I'm back now. Luckily I had some things to do while I left this to go. Okay. Let's see, jammer. Ready? Here we go. Oh, my beautiful. France is so lovely, but I do miss your face. Just in case you are missing mine, here is a photo. Look at how happy I am thinking of you. Okay, I'm trying to see, like. She said that in the photos we get like some kind of hidden message or whatever. What's the hidden message here? Is this the hidden message? Is this the hidden message? Because it looks kind of like a D. Is she saying she wants the Okay, no. <laughs> now imagine how happier I would be if you were here in my arms. My Sherry, you look positively gorgeous today. The Sakura Blue! You are a babe, as they would see in America. Mon chéri, you are more beautiful than a summer's day, more lovely and more temperate. Okay, no. Like I said, and I don't even know what video I've said it, but that's the only one of Shakespeare's sonnets I have partially memorized. A long time ago, I used to have it almost fully and completely memorized. <laughs> you are making me giggle, my darling. I am blushing. People are staring. I have been to Lavoir. Uh, I've never known how to pronounce that. Versailles. And now I am making my way to the Eiffel Tower. It is funny, we. I have lived in Paris so long, but have not been to where the tourists go since I was a little girl. There's this fruit stand down the street I've never stopped at. Lived here for years. I love fruit. I like cake. Tors are a plague. I scoff in their general direction. Filthy Doris. I like cake. We are saboteurs of our own happiness, my love. Anyway, I was thinking about buying you a souvenir. I know how much you love your berets. Red beret, blue berets, green berets, pink beret. Okay. You didn't get me a pink beret. <laughs> I said green berets, but you are not in the military. Dang it, Francine, you almost blew my cover. 
Uh, I mean, neither am I. In the military. That would mean we are civilians. Yes, my darling. We are nothing but ordinary civilians. Doing our normal everyday life civilian things. Oh, um, what am I trying to say, darling? I don't know, what are you trying to say? Usually you conclude this joke with a Raspberry Beret reference. Which I love about you. Oh. I haven't heard that song in years. Usually, you just remind me that Beret reminds me of Buffet, and that I'd probably like that instead. No. Let's go with the Prince reference. Because... Why not? Oh, wee wee wee! I love the hockey! No. This is where I was going! Viva la Prince! Yep. Viva la Prince. And... Okay, 23 days. Okay, well, that's that. So, three more days for Claudia, unless I change my mind, which... Well, I shouldn't even say. For all I know, I might just change my mind. Who knows? Anyways, okay. So that'll do it for this episode. So next time around... We're probably gonna have... Actually, now that I think about it, we're gonna have Claudia in approximately three days. And then we're gonna have the continuation with Francine, who I'm assuming will most likely drag this out for another three to five days. Okay, well, that may have just made my decision for me right there. Because I don't want to be like in the middle of recording the Francine episodes, and then in the middle of it I'm gonna have the Claudia episodes, or episode, and then I'm gonna release the Francine episodes, which were recorded before the Claudia episodes, so everything's out of order and it's gonna confuse me, and confuse me even more than I'm confused right now as I'm trying to sort things out. Okay, well, in that case... I'll see what I do. Okay, well, I'm Art Shadow, and this has been Crush Crush for now. And I will see you guys next time with whatever else I do. Stay golden, and later, folks. This is